Hello friends, welcome back to a new video that is MCQs on microbial culture media and this is the part 6 of this series of videos on microbial culture media. So the first question is question number 101 that is a medium better suited as transport media for Neisseria gonorrhoeae is option A McConkey's agar, option B is towards transport media, option C EMB transport media or option D all of the above and the right one is option B that is Stewart's transport media. So a media better suited as transport media for Neisseria gonorrhoeae is Stewart's transport media. Okay, so let's move on to question number 102 that is plate count are designated as option A number of cells per ml, option B that is number of cells per ml, option B CFU, option C CFU per ml, option D all of the above. So the right answer is option C that is CFU per ml. So plate count are designated as CFU per ml. Okay. So next one is 103 that is the culture media that supports simultaneous growth of morphologically dissimilar bacteria is called as option A selective media, option B differential media, option C enriched media, option D transport media and the right answer is option B that is differential media. So the culture media that supports simultaneous growth of morphologically dissimilar bacteria is called as differential media. Okay. So let's move on to question number 104 that is suborders medium is regarded as selective media for option A gram positive bacteria, option B yeast, option C gram negative or option D all of the above. So suborders media is regarded as selective media for option B that is for yeast and this suborders dextrose agar is a growth media used to isolate and cultivate fungi and yeast. It can also grow filamentous bacteria like nocardia. Okay. So it is this suborders media is used for yeast. Okay. So let's move on to question number 105. So, in order to gain an isolated colony, which of the following is best suited suitable technique? And the options are option A, pore plate, option B, spread plate, option C, strict plate, or option D, all of the above. So, the right one is option C, that is strict plate. So, strict plate method is the most suitable method to gain an isolated colony. Okay. So, let's move on to 106. So what is the chief reason to use semi-solid media and the options are option A check importance of agar percentage, option B check colony characters and primarily the pigment formation, option C to check the motility of culture or option D all of the above. So the right answer is option C that is to check the motility of culture. So which of the chief reason to use semi-solid media? It is to check the motility of culture. Okay. So let's move on to question number 107. It is solid media is hard enough to give platform for colony growth and isolation. But what actually make media solid like this hard? And the options are addition of hydrogen, option B, addition of oxygen, option C, addition of agar, or option D, addition of thioglycolate. So the right answer is option C that is addition of agar is the reason for hardness of the media. So solid media is hard enough to give platform for colony growth and isolation but what actually makes media solid like this hard that is addition of agar. Okay. So next is 108. So what media is better suited for isolation of fastidious organisms and options are option A solid media, option B enriched culture media, option C differential culture media or option D anaerobic thioglycolate media. So the right answer is option B that is enriched culture media. So enriched culture media is better suited for isolation of fastidious or organisms. Okay. 
next one is 109 that is when the organism which is expected to grow on the media but still we get the growth of unidentified new colony what is it is said to be so the options are option a an uh, ac axonic culture option b novel culture option c transformed culture or option d contamination so the right answer is option d that is contamination so when the organisms which is expected to grow on the medium but still we get unidentified colonies that is known as contamination okay so let's move on to question number 110 during the cultivation of microorganisms for various research purpose we have to offer certain abiotic elicitors such as option a enzymes option b heavy metal ions option c amino acids or option d all of the above and the right answer is option b that is heavy metal ions so during cultivation of microorganisms for various research purposes we have to offer certain abiotic elicitors that is heavy metal ions okay next one is 111 that is if optimum ph is condition at which growth is excellent then what is optimum growth so the options are optimum growth option a optimum growth at optimum nutrients option b growth rate in balance with constant chemical composition with optimum nutrient supplied or option c optimum time to grow option d all of the above so what is the correct explanation about the optimum growth and the right answer is option b that is growth rate in balance with constant chemical composition with optimum nutrients supplied okay so next is question number 112 so consider a situation where culturing media is rich in substance enough to avail choice to grow the bacteria or bacteria of preference then the medium is called as option a differential media option b enriched media option c selective media or option d transport media and the right one is option c that is selective media so considering a situation where culturing medium is rich in substance enough to avail choice to grow the bacteria of preference so for bacteria of paper growing bacteria of preference the media is used that is selective media okay so next one is 113 so which of the following features suggest that culture of given organism in medium is anaerobic in nature and the options are option a foul or pungent order option b gas production option c sulfur granules presence option c all of the above and the right one is option d it is all of the above so which of the following features suggest that culture of given organism in media is anaerobic in nature that is pungent or foul order gas production sulfur granules presence so the next question is question number 114 so what type of media are peptone water and nutrient broth so what type of media they are and the options are option A differential media, option B basal media, option C selective media, option D enriched general media. So the right answer is option B, they are basal media. Okay. So let's move on to 115. So one of the following, uh, sorry, one of the following, it is a direct method of cell mass measurement. That is option A cell drive weight option b viscosity option c heat evolution option d ribosome composition in live cells and the right answer is option a that is cell dry weight so one of the following is a direct method of cell mass measurement is cell dry weight okay so these are all questions in this part 6 video on microbial culture media okay so thank you for watching this video.